guys, so since back to school videos are all over YouTube now and I feel so late for not making one of these Though my school starts in September so I don't really feel like it's the so back to school season So tell me in the comments below when your school starts because I feel like I'm the only one whose school starts in September So anyway today I decided to show you the must haves back to school essentials You know to have in your bag because these might be very like so basic but they would save the day and you need them And let's start off with the hygiene products that I think you should always carry a deodorant with you because especially in summer we get so sweaty we just might smell and stuff so a deodorant can really save your day um you would always need it and you would also can take a body spray or something because this is easier to apply maybe a deodorant you would have to go to the bathroom or something but you can throw this on so quickly and it would just save you because for me i sweat a lot so i really need this in my bag you can also take some wipes with you, it's not really like you really really need it, but you might need it sometimes, maybe like something spills on you, maybe when you're eating something happens, just you wanna like free all your body from the dirt and stuff, so this can also help you so much. Next things are things which you just really need for your own like self to be comfortable and stuff, and the first thing might be very basic, but you actually need that, and I see so many people don't care this, and it's a bottle of water. In summer, we just we just get so exhausted because of the sun, the hotness. Um, you might feel so thirsty a lot, and you don't want to be that person who would keep running around the school looking for someone to just give them some water because this is annoying for you and for other people, and you don't want to just go find someone every single day so you would have some water with. So carrying a little bot bottle of water is really helpful. Really makes you feel so ready and relaxed and comfortable because feeling thirsty is horrible, especially in summer. So just carrying this with you is. Seriously, a lifesaver. I really must carry a water bottle with me. This is just a must. Next thing is for your phone, and it is it's not something that you have to take with you, but be sure that your phone is fully charged before you go to school or at least has a good percentage of charging, you know, so that you want, even if you have a charger with you, you don't want to just keep your phone somewhere and not be able to take it with you everywhere and just, you know, feel like, you know, it's much easier for you to not need to charge it along the day just be sure it's charged next thing is some tissues because we definitely like you know our school year you really need tissues and sometimes sometimes you really need them and again you don't want to be that person who would be running around the school looking for someone to give them some tissues so feeling ready and actually taking these things makes you feel so ready and comfortable and like confident because you know that you are ready for anything um and this is just so little and small and like light so you can just it will do you no harm to take them just to be ready for anything that can happen and you definitely will need them just if you washed your hand or face or something if something spilled on you um you might really need these next thing is a rubber band or a ponytail holder or just whatever you would call these because in summer again your hair might get so crazy um it might make you feel like so hard because you know hair is all over our bodies makes us feel so hot so taking this can also make you feel a lot better especially in summer because sometimes I really feel so bad when I have my hair all over my face and like my neck and stuff it just makes me feel so hot and I feel so bad when I don't have a rubber band to just tie my hair up in a ponytail with me so also your hair you know might you know have flyaways and stuff so this can be a lifesaver also next thing is some gum because it's actually not a gum like thingy but I don't have gums now so I just you know thought I would just hold this just as an example but it's not even gums look I'm so weird. Anyways, um, that's for the stapler thing. Okay, I'm so weird. Anyways, I don't know. I even did this. Anyways, um, sometimes you didn't really eat, eat breakfast. Um, sometimes you just have no time. So having some gum in your bag can always be a lifesaver because you don't want um, to have this smell coming out of your mouth when you talk because you didn't really eat something in the morning. So just. If you just didn't have the time to eat something, then a gum can really save your life in that. Next, uh, just, you know, other things, you know, just other things. I don't really know what category they would be put in. And next thing is a watch, because if you go to a school like mine, uh, my school, some classes won't have clocks on it. And some people say it's better because they don't want to just keep looking at the clock um, during all the classes so that the time wouldn't pass by and you would just keep being distracted by the clock. You want like this session to end or stuff. So anyways, 
haven't watched to just have because you don't want to also be that person who keep asking everybody around them what time is it what time is it and you would always have it in your hand it's really easy to know but also it's not good to just keep looking at the watch during all these sessions because you you know a watched water doesn't boil that's what they say so um, you don't really have to keep looking at it but sometimes it will make your life easier because sometimes you just are so bored and, don't, and you want to know when just this session would just come to an end because it's so boring anyways next thing is a spare notebook um, it doesn't have to be that big I for me and myself I really like to have this very little copy book or notebook just to for anything maybe when me and my friends want to play something when I have something to write down when I want to write, write down some notes having a like coffee book or a notebook which doesn't belong to any subject it's just another spare one to write anything you want to write draw doodle um maybe just you know do anything having this is also really great next tip is uh, okay i'm just getting the things anyway next tip is it's not really something essential but something general if you know you have a math class for example take a calculator don't just be too lazy to have it in your bag maybe just put it somewhere and just when you have a math um session just take it with you if you know you would need a pencil or a ruler for geometry for just biology anything take them with you don't be that type of person who would always want to borrow things from other people because it's annoying for you and for them again so I be that sometimes because you know when like the first day of school I would be very ready and I would have everything in my backpack but then I just don't care anymore I just throw any pen I have and then just I just go which is really not good because sometimes I need some things and I just it's not nice to keep just borrowing from people so just be ready and even have pencil correct if you use it um, ruler if you know you would use these things then take them with you don't be lazy even you can just keep them in your bag don't even get them out of the bag and maybe you can have another ones for your home so that you wouldn't have to get them out of the bag because maybe you would forget after that to put them right back again or maybe you would just be too lazy to so that's it I hope oh wait 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 no that's not it I forgot to say one point there's the most important thing you have to take with you to school, which is positivity. The most important thing you have to take with you, you have to take with you, yeah, to school, your smile. So, be positive, because you know, school time is drama time. You keep interacting with people, people everywhere, every day, you just have things to do. Don't take everything so seriously, just let things go, be positive, take a smile with you and all that stuff. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked it, please give it a big thumbs up and tell me in the comments below the videos you'd like to see next. Tell me when your school starts and what other back to school videos you would like to see. And I hope I find anybody else whose school starts in September just like me. So yeah, thanks so much for watching and bye!